Good morning, everyone. Welcome to another video. Um, it is CitizenCon, but the stream hasn't started yet. And I am in between fulfilling some orders. And I remembered that I wanted to do the eBay video when I skipped last time because there hasn't been a lot going on. There still hasn't been in the last four or five weeks. But yeah, let's look at this. There has been sold an Arkin Rising First Edition Complete Rainbow Foil set for 1010. This um, doesn't specifically show things like Command and Conquer, but anyways, I think it's in here. Then we've had a Crucible of War First Edition Sealed Booster Box case. This one shows two, but he has shipped one for 1100. Another one, Crew First Edition, 1111. Um, an Arcan Rising First Edition box in an acrylic case for a thousand two hundred. We've had a Welcome to Wrath First Edition for one thousand two hundred and twenty. Seems like those prices are going down a bit, and well, like I said, not much has been sold. And then another Arcan Rising First, one thousand two hundred and fifty. That one came from Australia. And then Crucible of War first edition 1300. So that's different. Okay, another one. Booster box. Welcome to Ralph. First edition. Acrylic case 1777. Last but not least, we've had a Fiendal Spring Tuning. Finally, at least one card being sold. This one looks pretty good. Um, 3250. So that's it. That's what happened. Items over a thousand in the past, what is it, nine weeks? Eight or nine weeks? So, it has been quiet with the collectors. But, yeah, now towards the end of year, usually sales pick back up. I'm going to be back with another video. I'm going to do the expected value video for Dusk to Dawn. Curious to see how that can hold up. It's super unusual that the EV is so high now that the demand is there for other cards from other sets. Those prices should go down. We shall see. Have a good day. Uh, until later. Bye.